Uh, hey guys, so it's 6 a.m. I have to get to work in about 20 minutes and it's gonna suck. But this drop, this banner drop, or this banner is gonna drop rather, on the 31st, two days from now, three days from now. Um, <laughs> I'm really gonna, do, I'm really glad they're doing this. Like they're calling it a Lost Agent story arc, um, which is which I like because they're using basically the characters. We're gonna take a look at these guys in a minute, but um, they're using kind of it's not manga characters. Like Soyphon is is in her is what she looked like in her manga, you know. Uh, but you did get to see her in at the end of the Lost Agents arc. You did get to see Shinji at the end of the Lost Agents arc. So like, it, I'm glad that they're using the way they appear, and they're not calling them manga characters. That gives me a lot of hope for uh, some of the other like characters that you'll get to see that maybe won't be manga characters, but they'll still be like post time skip characters. So I'm excited for this, and I'm glad that we get another soy phone because we did need another soy phone, and these characters will go to premiums, so you can eventually get them and I guess you can't take a look at them because their stuff isn't there <laughs> whoops still though pretty cool um dang I was, I was hoping we get to take a look at them I guess not but yeah this could mean that we might eventually get another Kensei um another Rose maybe but I don't know that Rose would have a Bankai in the Lost Agents arc because you only got to see it in the manga, so it's possible that we don't. Um, but yeah, other characters might include like literally anybody else in the society that you got to see, which I'm glad. And we finally get Ryukin, which is pretty cool. Um, but yeah, this is this is this is pretty cool. Uh, I'm actually. So, so it's really good because like I really wanted a Shinji that was a new captain Shinji that was basically like this and you can see he has this hollow mask but you never see what he's wearing his captain uh, cloak but I wonder if this means they're gonna start remaking the visors although you don't see the other visors in the other time skip though they do desperately need the remake um, this is really cool. This is really cool. I'm glad they're doing this. I'm glad it's not another manga uh, uh, list, just because I'm still dry on orbs from Halloween and the last manga characters. Um, but I am glad it's going to be a post time skip thing, and I hope we get to see other characters like that because I do like the way like Izuru and like Rangiku and some of the other characters. I like the way that their design is. Uh, after the time skip so I'm excited to see characters that look like that and I'm glad that they're not like hey look after manga characters it's done no we still have a long way to go so clearly they're gonna be like manga character times to gotcha something else and then it's gonna this game's gonna keep going it's not like what I feared that it was gonna be like oh manga characters movie characters we're done so no clearly they're gonna keep going and this is very exciting so yeah let me know what you guys think uh, and I will, I will continue to look for updates about this and try to review the characters when they're out in the BBS, uh, the FYI page. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think and I have to go eat something because I got it to work. So take care.